Attention all devoted fans of the Dallas Cowboys. If you're as passionate about staying ahead of the game and being the first to catch all the breaking news about our beloved Dallas Cowboys, then subscribing to our channel is an absolute must. Your support means the world to us, and it's what fuels our dedication to delivering the freshest updates directly from the heart of the action in Dallas itself. So, before we dive into the latest news, make sure you've subscribed and turned on notifications. Your subscription is vital in helping us reach our goal of 11,000 subscribers. Alright, let's get into it. Expectations always tend to be higher for the Dallas Cowboys than the average NFL team. That may be more true now than ever before, given how the last three seasons have gone for the most scrutinized franchise in team sports. Dallas has looked dominant in the regular season, posting a 12-5 record three years in a row. However, playoff success has been elusive. They've gone 1-3 in the postseason, including a humiliating blowout at the hands of the Green Bay Packers last year. While it may seem like they have gone as far as they can, starting quarterback Dak Prescott seems to believe that this team can get over the hump in its current form, saying he's confident in the men they have, per Todd Archer at ESPN. Prescott said, you don't just win games with just talent. And you don't win games on paper, and talent is really not decided on paper. So I understand what it looks like, what it may look like from that side, understanding the lack of moves that get done. It creates that great conversation. I'm confident in the men we have, honestly. Prescott mostly has it right. The Cowboys could use a little more help at a few positions, but overall this is a very strong roster that's been built to make a deep postseason run. Breaking through to the other side may not require any changes to the team, but rather a change in leadership. Head coach Mike McCarthy deserves credit for helping make this Dallas team a contender, but if he can't deliver an NFC Championship game appearance this year, he may be on his way out. Now, I want to hear from you, Cowboys Nation. Do you believe that Dak Prescott is right about the current roster's potential? Drop a Y for yes or an N for no in the comments section below. Do you think the team needs more talent, or do you agree with Dak that it's more about leadership and execution? And don't just vote, let us know why you feel that way. Your opinions matter, and we love hearing from you. While all of this is speculation without any inside information on the Cowboys' stance, there is no doubt that the Jones family has had these conversations. They've been clear about their concerns regarding paying a quarterback a premium salary as it limits the team's spending ability elsewhere. In fact, some reports suggest that owners are considering the idea of a separate salary cap for quarterbacks to address this issue. This situation is not unique to the Cowboys. Other teams are also grappling with how to balance paying a star quarterback while maintaining a competitive roster. The idea of letting a high-priced quarterback walk and replacing him with a younger, cheaper option is gaining traction across the league. And if anyone thinks Stephen Jones wouldn't consider such a move, they don't know Stephen Jones very well. Let's compare Dak Prescott to other quarterbacks. Dak has been the face of the franchise and has delivered consistently, but there's no denying the allure of a younger, potentially cheaper option. What do you think? Should the Cowboys stick with Dak or consider exploring other options? Vote in the poll and share your thoughts. From a financial perspective, sticking with Dak means stability and experience, but also a significant salary cap hit. On the other hand, a younger quarterback could provide the flexibility needed to keep other key players. This approach also comes with risks. Developing a young quarterback takes time and patience, and there's no guarantee of success. Cowboys Nation, your input is crucial here. Should the team focus on developing a young quarterback or stick with Dak? Head down to the comments section and let us know your thoughts. And remember, if you're enjoying the content, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and enable the notification bell. Your subscription is very important to us and helps us bring you more great content. We appreciate every one of you in our Cowboys community. Before we wrap up, let's consider the potential benefits of having Dak Prescott as our quarterback. He brings experience, leadership, and a deep understanding of the game. His connection with the team and the fans is undeniable. 
On the flip side, bringing in a fresh face could inject new energy and potential into the team. It's a tough decision with many factors to weigh. Now, shifting gears to the coaching side of things. Mike McCarthy has been a pivotal figure in the Cowboys' recent success. However, if he fails to take the team to an NFC Championship game this year, his tenure could be in jeopardy. What do you think, Cowboys fans? Should McCarthy be given more time, or is it time for a change in leadership? Drop a T for time or C for change in the comments below. Your feedback is important, and we value your opinions. Let's dive deeper into the stats. Dak Prescott's performance in clutch situations often gets overlooked due to the broader narrative surrounding his postseason record. Yes, there's fair criticism for his playoff shortcomings, but his regular season performance is among the best in the league. His ability to maintain composure and deliver under pressure is second to none. This isn't just about numbers, it's about the confidence and leadership he brings to the field. What do you think, Cowboys fans? Is Dak getting the credit he deserves, or are we too focused on his playoff record? Vote in the poll and share your thoughts. The broader narrative around Prescott often focuses on his playoff performance, but let's not forget the countless times he's led the Cowboys to victory in critical regular season games. His resilience and determination are qualities every team looks for in a quarterback. So, what's the real story here? Is Dak Prescott underrated when it comes to clutch moments, or do we need to see more from him in the playoffs? Cowboys Nation, your input is crucial. Do you agree with the sentiment that Dak Prescott is underrated? Should we start recognizing him as a top-tier quarterback based on his regular season performance? Head down to the comments section and let us know your thoughts. And remember, if you're enjoying the content, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and enable the notification bell. Your subscription is very important to us and helps us bring you more great content. Before we wrap up, let's consider what makes a quarterback truly great. It's about more than just stats. It's about the ability to stay calm under pressure, make the right decisions, and lead your team to victory when it matters most. Dak Prescott has shown time and again that he has these qualities. Yes, the postseason is important, but building a narrative around a few games can be misleading. We need to look at the full picture. So, what's your take, Cowboys fans? Should we reevaluate how we view Dak Prescott's performance? Is he truly the leader we need, or do we need to see more from him in the playoffs? Cast your vote in our community poll and let us know your thoughts in the comments. Also, don't forget to share this video with your friends and fellow Cowboys fans. Let's keep the conversation going and see what the majority thinks. Thanks for tuning in to Cowboys News TV. We'll be keeping an eye on this story and updating you with any new developments. Be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on any breaking news. Your support helps us grow and reach our goal of 11,000 subscribers. We appreciate every one of you in our Cowboys community. Until next time, go Cowboys!